Bonjour, hello and welcome to Max Mountain World. Bonjour, hello and welcome to the Man Cave. A little bit of a mess I know but I'll come back to that. The intro gives a little clue as to how this video might end as well. Now I was out on my walk this morning inside the building doing my thinking and stuff and something was bugging me about a video that I did the other day. I'll put a link into it up, up, <laughs> on my ceiling and <laughs> I'm doing three things here in this video. One, I'll explain this. Two, this is coming to the end. And three, I'm going to do this with my GoPro 7 White. Now, I've adapted this. I've got, that's a, a presentation stand that came with my first GoPro. And I've got all these little twisty doofery things that kind of uh, I've amassed over the, <laughs> over the years with GoPros and various camera things. So anyway, I've set this up. And what is quite handy for actual internal stuff. So I can adapt it, I can turn it, I can have it forward, I can have it higher, I can twist it, I can, I can do anything with it. And I'm going to use that because the GoPro actually has really good audio qualities. Now, throughout this I'm aware that um, the, the camera itself does actually, that lens is kind of like a fisheye lens for things up close. So, uh, here goes for video and a bit of experimentation, some <whistles> super solutions, simple solutions. This is, this is really interesting, really good and I think it's pretty clever. So. The one thing I would say is that uh, just a quick thought came to mind in a play with words is that quite often I've done things in my life and people have actually presented me with a phrase that's pretty common in, uh, in the English language. You know, I've said to them, oh, I, 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 was, I, I painted the wheels on, on, my, on my hoover this morning or something. They, they turn around and say, you've got to get out more. Nowadays, there's a whole new phrase where instead of saying you've got to get out more, they say you've got to stay in more. So, I'm staying in more. This is what I'm doing. Here's the video. Not a lot happening on 11 metres on the radio this morning. And sound. Ham radios like my Yaesu FT450D here come with a speaker built into the top and other mobile rigs as they say like CBs and stuff the, the, the speaker they put underneath which comes from when the truckers used to use them and uh, the truckers used to have them sort of on the ceiling of their cab, you know, with the microphone cable hanging down and stuff, and they'd pull the mic down, yeah, break a one nine ten four, good buddy, and all that crap. And uh, the speaker was in an appropriate position with the with the ham radio, the speaker there. It's it's going up the way. I I'm not there. I'm here. So I've been experimenting with a couple of things since I did that video. So we'll just turn that on. I'll put the microphone away because I'm not going to need it. In its usual parking space. Did you notice the difference in the sound there? So, experiment number one. See how you get on with the GoPro in here and its sound qualities. Experiment number two uh, is... I'm going to build an audio amplifier for this radio that cost many hundreds of euros. And to do so, and I need to turn it on. What I'm going to do is I'm going to go on to a, a military um, weather forecasting and information um, frequency. And I'm going to use that for the purposes of this experiment. 
general cloud scattered 3,000 feet. Temperature one minor two point one one QMH one zero one seven. I've set up the GoPro so it's exactly halfway between my head and the speaker on the radio. Just to explain the principle of what I'm doing. Visibility, one zero kilometers on all cloud, to one thousand two hundred feet, temperature one five, two point one two, QMH one zero one minor. Now, what I built and what I'm using here is I've got uh, ten items <laughs> from things that I've brought out from in and around the Max Mountain World Global Headquarters. Now the first item I built took me all of uh, two minutes and uh, yes I did time it and uh, I'll, I'll, I'll give it a shot now. Rubbish. So that was the first item. Number two. Uh, aerosol cap. Mm. I could always tape it down if it works. Rubbish. Three, the aforementioned tape. I would give that one out of ten. Number three, the root of the first one. Two out of ten. Third part of the box from the GoPro Seven. One out of ten. Next, a Euro Millions ticket that was a winner. Yay! Four euros seventy. Two out of ten. Next is the rest of the GoPro 7 box. One out of ten. My last expired passport. Oh. I'll give that a 4 out of 10. Small biscuit box. On the current scale, that one's going to 5. Past a box with the back and the bottom, no, the top, cut out of it and inverted. I'll give that a three. And finally, the bit I cut out the back of that box modified a shade. With an angle, with the amplification type megaphone effect. I'm going to give that a six. That is. And it's more, well, and it's more practical too because it's not covering up any of the vents, 
at all. I can just pick it up and shove it on. It's not blanking my view of the tablet behind. And that was quite, quite, a, quite a spectacular difference, I think you'll agree. And so now on to part three, or the third experiment, which that kind of tidies up the desk a bit, is along the same themes. The intro I did here, I played around with this and it does actually work. Uh, the camera on the tripod. <laughs> yeah, because the microphone is actually there. It's a stereo microphone. And uh, I, I've experimented with the sound of this. <laughs> with me sitting uh, at, there's a kitchen, with me sitting in the, the office, as it were, and, yeah, that one worked too. So there's today's video, three experiments in one. Not sure how the GoPro thing's going to turn out. Uh, we'll see. Apologies if it's not very good, but I think it'll be okay. And, uh the winner out of the 10 was the self-made one. Cut the back out of the box, bent it a little bit just to give it a little angle forward, which in so doing kind of brought it into a sort of megaphone type shape, a two-dimensional megaphone type shape. I'm chuffed. That actually works. I find it kind of difficult. Maybe it's an age thing with my hearing. Although in my last uh, medical in January, uh, there was no problem there. But... I found it difficult to actually make out exactly what that automated service was saying. And I found it a lot easier with that. Fantastic. Okay, so anyway, that's today's video. Thanks very much for watching. And uh, don't forget, you can subscribe, you can click on the alert bell, and that gives you notifications on future videos that I'm doing. If you like this, give it a thumbs up and make comments, whatever. Again, thanks very much for watching. Your support is much appreciated. Until the next one, ciao. Temperature 18, 2.3.